A South Carolina teacher is dead this morning from complications caused by COVID-19. Richland School District 2 officials say 28-year-old Demetria Bannister taught third grade at Windsor Elementary School. We're told she was last inside the school on August 28th and was not showing any symptoms. Showing off dance moves in the school building was the norm for third grade teacher Demi Bannister. She provided us with, of course, a lot of character. She was just amazing. One of the hardest thing is just to talk about Demi in past tense. Richland 2 was notified Miss Bannister tested positive for COVID-19 on September 5th. She died just three days later. It's challenging. We are really just beginning to process this loss. District Superintendent Baron Davis says Miss Bannister's last day in the building was August 28th, the last work day for teachers before the start of the year. We did everything that we that we were um, that we were supposed to do uh, in communicating and making sure that our the space was properly um, Sanitize. Unbelievable, just absolutely heartbreaking. And this is as Trump and the Republicans are pushing to reopen schools to basically full capacity. The Republican coronavirus skinny bill, which Pelosi called the emaciated bill, it really is revolting. And I broke it down the other day on the channel, just how little relief it, it gives. But a huge part of the focus is funding to reopen schools. And then we see what happens here. She was so young, 28 years old, and it was so sudden. That's what gets me. Within three days, they said in that report. It just, eh, this is gonna keep happening. This September, less than two weeks after she was at school as part of her preparation to begin her third year of teaching the third grade, Bannister died of complications caused by the coronavirus. Bannister was at the school on August 28th, which was the last work day for teachers before the school year began. She started teaching her third grade class virtually from her home on August 31st. Bannister then tested positive for COVID-19 on September 4th and died three days later. The school district said that it was sharing information about Bannister's death with permission from her parents who wished to remind others about the seriousness of this disease caused by the coronavirus. I'm just hopeful that her death will be a reminder to the public that this coronavirus is mean, it's nasty, it does not discriminate, and that's that it's devastating, Bannister's uncle, Hayward Bannister, told BuzzFeed News. It disrupts families' lives. Hayward, 68, said that Bannister was always his favorite niece, and I have many of them, he added. He could tell from when she was a child that Bannister was a spirited person who always wanted to nurture, care, and love others. When Bannister began her education career five years ago as a fifth grade teacher at Windsor Elementary, Hayward knew it was the perfect fit for her. She had the temperament and the interest in cultivating, elevating, and molding young minds, he said. And now she's gone because Republicans want to pretend like everything's normal. 192,000 deaths and counting and counting. And they keep wanting to say it's just old people, it's just sick people, as if that's okay. No, she was 28, she was healthy, she was asymptomatic, she did not understand that she had COVID-19, and what do you know? And kids could have come to school too and gotten it. This was before children were entering the school, but it's just, it's yet another tragedy. And rest in peace, Demi.